There you go. There's more? I can't eat all this. Don't sweat it, Chairman. Us young folks can handle this chap. Oh, definitely. My stomach's a bottomless pit. Bon appetit. Hell yeah! We get so focused on our food that we forgot to actually discuss anything. Oh, it is damn good. Yeah, yeah. But we have to get down to business. Guess I'm kicking us off. This is Kunmekun, leader of Bleach Japan's Yokohama branch. He's going to run for this district's representative seat in the next election. Now what you gotta understand about this kid is he's just step one of Ryo Aoki's scheme to turn Injincho into his personal political machine. Zhao's correct. Kume is just one step. Aoki's other steps include a huge number of Bleach Japan candidates all over the country. Yeah, I noticed that too. Ah, <sighs> and the dam is broken. There's no stopping it now. Governor Aoki's too popular. There's no one who can stand up to him. So you think Kume's win is a done deal, Chairman Oshino? Pretty much. Kume has Aoki's broad public adoration at his back. Throwing Aoki's fundraising and media savviness. Kume's got a very real shot at this. I'd say so. He wants Ijincho so bad it's gotten personal for him. Since it was Ogikubo's kingdom before, seizing it makes Aoki the new heir apparent. That's gotta be what he's thinking. Yes. I'd venture to say that even if the Citizens' Liberal Party wins every other district, he won't be satisfied unless he wins this one. gonna throw everything he's got at this contest. Definitely. Well, I'm not gonna roll over and just take it. Anybody with me? With you on what? On taking this dude down a peg. I'm sick of getting our asses kicked. We all are, but... We can't just let him win. We need to do something. I mean, Bleach Japan is in bed with the Omi Alliance. Isn't that fucked up? It's, you know, hypocritical. They go around preaching about how Grey Zones need to go, acting like they're heroes or something. Meanwhile, they team up with gangsters to take over Japan, and everyone just claps for them? Thing is, Kasuga, these gangsters have a governor on their side. They're untouchable. Are you guys even hearing yourselves right now? What's gotten into you? The Ejin Three used to protect the weak and vulnerable in this town. Granted, you did it by running a huge scam, so I'm not gonna give you too much credit. But after everything the city's given you, don't you feel like you owe something to it? Look, I know none of you guys did what you did just for the money. Ogikubo was the one raking in all the dirty riches. 
You guys wanted to stop a war from destroying this town. And if you don't stand up now, you're basically abandoning the Aging Three's purpose. It's a description. You sure you want to finish that thought? Yeah, dial it down, or I'll set you straight. Well, I for one agree with him. Uh, you do? Everything you said is true. We all lived in the Grey Zones, and sure, that ain't something to be proud of. But at least we could be proud of putting food on the tables of our men and their families. You're with me on that, at least. Right, Songwei? If we roll over, we will be throwing away everything we've ever worked for. Zhao... No, it's true. And remember, I left the Liumo in your hands. I trusted you to consider what my men need. This is shaping up to be your first job as their new boss. Come on, Songwei. Damn it. Fine. Uh, Chairman Hoshino, you got any wisdom of your own to lend us? Well, I do understand the need to be fair to the city. I'll help. And to think, <laughs> I only came here for the food. Didn't expect to get roped into some noble last stand. You know what they say, there's no such thing as a free lunch. True that. Now let's go take care of Kume. I have to admit, I will enjoy knocking that little punk off his pedestal. So what's a move? Good question. We need to strike, but how? Don't you think it's obvious? No. What? We need to ruin the young master's reputation. Meaning? We gotta make sure Kume loses the election. How do you propose we do that? Um, that part I hadn't really figured out. But once we do, it'll be like kicking Aoki right in the face! I don't see how it's feasible. We could maim him. If he's too injured, he'd have to pull out of the race, and then... You wanna kill him? Well, only if he resists. We can't do that. If he dies, they'll just replace him with some other tool. I'm sure they've got backup candidates waiting in the wings. Hey, winning. That's how we do it. We just win it ourselves! Huh? We win the election, with our own candidate. Put someone up who can get more votes than Kume. There's gotta be someone out there who can do it. Yes, probably. But how do we figure out who this someone is? <laughs> We're not political consultants. Well, we should remember the votes for Kume aren't really for him in the first place. Their votes for Aoki. Good point. Can you think of anyone who fits the bill, Chairman Hoshino? Unfortunately, I... Can't say I do. Ogi Kubo was an incumbent here for many years, with no opponents who posed any real threat. The only people who ever ran against him just did so as a formality. Hey, you seem to know a lot about it. Why don't you run? Excuse me? Yeah, people know who you are. You've got charisma. 
No Yakuza's gonna win an election, even in the Jincho. If he did, I'd consider the world doomed. <laughs> Seriously. But I could try to recruit someone who would have a chance in the race. That's a start. Hope you're not expecting me to shoulder this burden alone, though. What do you mean? Elections cost money. A lot of money. If I find a candidate, who's footing the bill for the campaign? Mm -mm. I'll tell you right now, my people don't have a single yen to spare. Right, so... Uh, how much is it exactly? I'm willing to chip in some myself. But I'll need an additional three million yen cash just to register. Three million? You need that much? At a minimum. If you can't scrape that amount together, this plan is dead in the water. <sighs> I hate to say it, but he's right. Can you do it, Kasugaku? Let's get down to business. job to do. We got a job to do. Luck is 
Here's where the business did. These nice. are you guys did great results. out there. お任せください。I'll do it.
お世話になりましたの見せ所ですね。We got a job to do.
not that over here. Are you done with all the fun and games yet? I'm in the Come on now! to the end.
それでは。どちらまで行かれますか。そうですか。Hold on, Ichiban. What's all this about going to Osaka? <laughs> Turns out Arakawa-san needs some help. My help. Mitsu just called me and said Arakawa-san's already on his way to Sotenbori. But why Osaka? I don't know. I didn't bother to ask. You realize Sotenbori is where the Omi Alliance is headquartered. You'll be screwed if your cover gets blown. Think about that, would you? All I need to think about is that Arakawa-san said he needs me. He's going to Osaka, so I'm going to Osaka. I don't care what anyone says about it. <sighs> he gets like this, Hidachi-san. And there's no point stopping him, is there? Loyalty is admirable, but jeez. Ichiban, what about Ijinsho? The election's coming up. We helped you make all that money to fight Ryo Aoki. Now you're just gonna leave us hanging? Not at all. We got the three million. I'm gonna go give it to the Seiryu clan. We may have the money, but that hasn't solved our lack of a candidate. Didn't Chairman Hoshino say he? Don't worry. He's the kind of guy who keeps his word. If we give him the cash, if you say so. Safe travels. Hey, don't encourage him to do such dangerous things. Kasuga, if you really are leaving, we're coming with you. Sounds good to me. I've never been to a. Guys, I'm not going there. As a... I'm going straight into the lion's den. Assuming Adachi-san is right, and that's where the Yomi home base. You guys don't need to get involved. This is. Come on, man. After all, we've been. Of course. I'm saying this because we're friends. If something Still sounds like a load of crap. To... Well, think what you want. But we got the three million. I'll see all of your. それでは。Yes.
Yes. Very well. Does my father really need to attend to this Sotomori thing personally? Yes. Remember, as acting Captain Arakawa is merely keeping the seed warm for Watase. Being there in person will be a show of respect and good faith. Fine. But why am I just now hearing about this? I said I wanted to know if he so much as breathed somewhere outside his usual places. My apologies, young master. I only just found out myself. Really now? Well, all we can do now is wait and see. Hmm? Wait and see what, exactly? Masaru Watase and Masumi Arakawa are finally meeting in person after how long? If I know my dad, they're not just gonna say hi and be on their merry ways. I highly doubt they're plotting anything. Isn't the Omi chairman still bedridden? I've heard it's terminal. Yes. That's correct. Then it's past time for a potential successor to be formally named. Actually, it may not be that urgent yet. But then again, the chairman might say Watase's release from prison is a good time to step down. And then Watase would become chairman, naturally. I'm sure his reign would be a very long one. But Omi history will take a very different course if, say, Watase disappeared. What? <laughs> I'm thinking dear old dad might try to make it happen. I don't know if that's Arakawa-san's style, exactly. You don't think so? Remember when I asked dad to sell out the Tojo clan during the 3K plan? Well, I never told him to bring in the Omi Alliance. He did that all on his own. I think it was a good decision, actually. Don't you? Uh, well, sure. Thanks to him, the Tojo were driven out of Kamurocho. The 3K plan was a wild success, and my approval rating skyrocketed. I expected the Tojo clan to fall hard, but I didn't think some third-rate Tojo vermin like Dad could ever worm his way into their top ranks. <laughs> Shrewd of him to do that during all the commotion. I thought he was a slow, antiquated Yakuza, and certainly not the type of man who could catch me off guard. Huh. I guess power really does corrupt, huh? Don't get me wrong. If Dad buries Watase and takes over the Omi Alliance, I benefit too. Having him there would be very convenient for me. There's just one thing that feels off. What's that? He hasn't told me about any plan to off Watase at their meeting. That's evidence against my theory. I'll have to see what happens. If all they do is greet each other, I was wrong. Look. <laughs> On the other hand, if he wastes Watase and still doesn't see fit to tell me, that would be a betrayal I cannot tolerate. Arakawa-san won't betray you. He better not. His little Yakuza club only has power because I extend it to them. <sighs> I've come a long way since the Kamurocho 3K plan. I'm at the top of the political pyramid now, which means I need to know what's happening in the underworld. The hierarchy should be very clear at this point, and I expect people to fall in line. That's a matter of policy, and family is no exception. Sawashiro, between me and my father, to whom would you swear complete fealty? Arakawa-san sent me to do as you command. His orders were to put you and your interests above everything else. My interest is for you to watch his every move and report them to me. Understood. 
I'll send Tendo to Osaka. He seems to have rapport with Arakawa-san. Ah, oh, Patriarch Tindo. When'd you get in? Just this afternoon. Tomorrow, the captain's getting out of prison. Oh, really? Hm. Not something civilians like you need to worry about. The wise thing to do would be to mind your own business. Is that a threat, sir? Don't joke like that, man. You fists ought to require a weapons permit. Say what now? Nothing. I got work to do, just like you... Hey, can I get a refill over here? Oh, make it two. Hey, Ichiban. You look like a teenage girl waiting for a text from her boyfriend. Put it down and relax. Never... Yeah, we're in Osaka after all. Stop giving me shit. See, this is why I want to come alone. Where are you going, Kasuga-san? I bet it's not to take a leak. He hardly drank a sip. Getting antsy waiting for this call from Mitsu. Didn't he say he was busy planning what Tase's something like that? Some big can he see that Arakawa sans plan? No, but wasn't he expecting you to be dude? You're the one who jumped the gun and got here early. Who are you, Mama Kasuga? Someone's gotta be. But hey, look, there was a group of people in here chatting about Arakawa being in town. Really? Yeah. Sounds like folks are worried that it's just a rumor. Shh. I... Yeah? Ah oh, man, what what's wrong? It's from Nico Ga- He texted me, I finally got a pick with Kamala. Great, so glad you told me- Ichiban, did you see my photo? Nobody- Funny, he's so crafty, you never know where his body- I'm beside myself, I- Right, all right. Huh? Uh, what's that- <sighs> I'm sorry, but- I'm- Well, look who's a busy bee. No, <laughs> it's nothing about girls! Listen, I'll call you when- <laughs> I was just teasing. Why are you so mad? I gotta go- Yeah. <sighs> uh, hey, Gus, if you're gonna be a pain in everyone, huh? come on. Since when decides? Or your precious. Hey, uh, you're absolutely. Yep! Yeah. Uh, like devils. Listen. Yep.
Yo. Okay. Skip. 
was that number? And visiting a new city, the most important thing. Hey, that's actually. Uh, uh, Good. Bring the pain. Here we go. You wanna fight? 